nice code coming through. And I brought the bag, I didn't expect to fit one in there. <laughs> and that's for the owner. Fabulous. Okay. These are the judges with the choice, their choice, if they can stick it in their bag and take it home. Mom, no, I'm coming in again. Hi, I got the really easy job because I didn't have to bring the cat up. It's actually sitting here. Beautiful cat. I think perhaps we better take it out from under the cushion. But gorgeous eyes, beautiful tabby pattern and the most beautiful personality. You're going to say the same. You can hold him up from there. Have a look at this pattern. Look at the expression. He really is gorgeous. He was my favourite that I'd like to take home. Thank you for showing him. Oh, by the way, I did want to have this black one. But, but Bernadette wrote the number down first. And then I got really cross with her. So that she sort of cheated a bit having this one. Well... My choice was this little, little one. Um, my judge's note said black and white. I went, someone's oh. cold light. This is a black cat. But the white, just a tiny bit. <laughs> Under the tummy, he truly is black and white. And when I judged him, he came out purring and he purred the whole time. So he was my choice. Um, unfortunately, I used up the last of my judge's choice ribbons at the ACF National Show in Sydney. But I do have, in addition for the owner, something rather more useful. <laughs> and that is the buy in the band below the pen. Oh. Oh. Okay, this cat is cat royalty. <laughs> Isn't he, Nick? <laughs> Yes, this is probably the nicest ragdoll I've ever seen. Um, he has such stage show presence. He doesn't, not phased by anything. And apart from that, he's a bloody good cat. <laughs> and if I bred ragdolls, this lady who owns him wouldn't, get, wouldn't be getting him back. Okay, I didn't get to judge the cat that I chose today, but I was told I could pick from anything in the room at all, which really opened up the field to me. And I've chosen this gorgeous redhead because I have a thing for redheads. And he is just, he's lovely. He's a superb cat. He's got a beautiful nature. He doesn't know me from that, and he's just sitting here quite happy. So he today is my choice. He's Now, what can I say? Beautiful. Oh, you awesome. Wait, sweetie. Well, I've managed to pick this. Anyone that's been showing for a number of years will know Turkish fans, terrible disposition. You know, they're the cat that's usually the one that's going off in the hall. No, <laughs> no this little bloke, besides being an exceptional cat for confirmation, has also got a super temperament. And I just couldn't go past him today. He was my best kitten, and he's also probably one I wouldn't mind seeing sitting out in the my cattery. But um, it's only the second time since I've been judging that I've made a Turk best, and uh, the other one was a uh, a Spain. So they're few and far between. So when they get one, they've really earned it. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Heather and Gary Brown had to leave earlier, so I will tell you. No, um, Heather Brown chose number 42, Marlu Lion. So I have a trophy for you. And Gary chose number 45, 
I see near Venus Victrix, so beautiful bangle up the back there. And I thought, because I was show manager, I'd have one to choose too. So it might be a little bit predictable, but I chose number 60. I'd love to take that cat home. Saboka Arata Karaoke, is that it? Yeah, come up here, I've got a present for you. My award is a um, $250 voucher to Bare Bones Photography. So you can get a professional photo rather than your daughter's photo. 